Well, hello everybody. This is Street Outlaws No Prep Talk with a round one update from No Prep Kings at Beach Bend. Now, photo goes directly to their photo owners. Please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings race series and all the other Street Outlaws shows. So, we had a pretty interesting round one with very good matchups and very good close racing. So, these are the round one winners from today's round one. Giuseppe, Greg Chandler, Scott Taylor, which had an awesome race against Chuck 55. Daddy Dave, which actually made a really good pass. Jim Howe, that beat Kayla, one of the really cool races, because Jim Howe got beat by Kayla last night. Now, Jim's trance break didn't hold on the GTR, and Kayla got the win. But today, Jim Howe beat Kayla pretty good. Now, Rich Bruder, Callie Mills also won. Now Axman beat Kai. Kai was ahead, but he got loose and threw the, the shoots, and Axman got the win. And Nate Saylor beat Ryan Martin. So Ryan is out first round again in the Invitational. Then we have Cal Canyon, Lissy, David Gates, Damon, which is starting to catch Kai in the points for the Invitational. Justin Swanstrom that beat Ron Roberts in a really good race. Manny Alvarez that beat Brandon James, and Murder Nova that beat Tim Brown, which is running in behalf of Team Swan Gang. So we have a lot of heavy hitters moving forward, but again, Ryan is out, and Kai Kelly, which is leading the points, is out as well. So this is the opportunity for everybody to start catching Kai in the points now Lissy and David Gates both moved on so they're still making points for team Kai Kelly but Daddy Dave's team has three in the next round Justin Sondstrom's team has three going to the next round so it's gonna be pretty tough but Ryan is still struggling he made a good pass but he just got outran by Nate and watch out for Nate guys that car is very fast he uh, ran against Swanstrom last night, and Swanstrom beat him, but by inches, basically. So watch out for Nate Taylor today. That man can drive, and that car is very fast, and it also has a Proline MH7 Hemi. So let's see what happens. It's definitely a really cool round one, and it's going to get even better in round two. A lot of very fast matchups, so... Let's see what happens. I will keep you posted. But the fact that Kai Kelly won the last two races and he is out round one. Now everybody has to start catching up Kai in the Invitational and also catching up to his team. So let's see what happens. Definitely a very interesting round one. And let's see how everything plays out.